Hello, good evening, everyone. I'm sorry to be late tonight, but I have some, some internet issues. It was hard to connect today. So thank you for waiting. Thanks a lot to be here with me. Let's get me a second. How are you today? Hello, Isidro, Alfa, Alba, Mario, Morena, Luis, Magdalena, Alexis, Glenda. Good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you? Hello. Hello. Good evening. Hi, good evening. How are you today? Hello. Fine. Very good. Very good. Ah, okay. Yes, it's because really nice. We are alive. We are alive. <laughs> it's really nice to you. know that you're good. Yes. Another day, heaven. <laughs> <laughs> okay, welcome to the class. Welcome to the class again. It's a pleasure to be with you tonight. Thanks a lot. Uh, yesterday, we were studying going to. Uh, we use going to to make sentences to talk about the future tense. So we were talking about uh, our next weekend plans. So do you remember how to do that? Can you tell me some examples of your plans for the next weekend? I'm going to go to the beach on Saturday. Okay, let's see the first example. You say, I am going to go. Then beach. I am going to go to the beach. Very good. That is a good sentence. A nice plan. Invite us, please, to go to the beach with you. Um, any other plan? Any other plan? Tell me. Somebody? Any volunteer? Say your I'm plans. going to party. Okay, you explain. You say, I'm going to go to a, a party. To a party. Excellent. I'm going to go to a party. Thanks a lot. Any other plan? I'm going to go to the to play bike. Excellent, Luis. Thank you. So you say, I'm going to ride. My, to, ride. to ride my bike. To ride my bike. Right. Okay, very good. That is a good exercise too. Your body is going to be happy. I okay. plan. Tell me, tell me one of your plans. I'm going to the beach with my family this weekend. Okay, you say I'm going to be it with my family this weekend yes okay you say next weekend because it's necessary to relax and relax oh yes you're right it is important to relax too right not only work but the most work uh, any other plan the last the last plan i'm going to with my friends I'm going to play uh, soccer. Okay, very good. I'm going to play soccer. With my friends. Okay, with my this friends. It's Saturday. On Saturday. On Saturday. Very good. Interesting plan. I'm going to play soccer with my friend. Okay, I hope you got fun. Okay, very good. Now, yesterday we also learned yes, no question. Do you remember that? Do you like to write on the chat? Do you text with your friends? Sorry? Do you text with your friends a lot? With, with our friend, no, but... Um... Yesterday, uh, I was doing uh, some exercise. 
in the oh, platform. You were typing some exercise on the platform. So very good. Now in the chat, I'm going to ask you some question and you are going to write the answer. So let's see, for example, are you going to go to the church? Can you type the answer on the chat, please? Let's discover who is going to be the first one. Vamos a ver quién es más rápido para escribir. In the chat, are you going to go to the church next weekend? Let's see. I don't have any answer yet. I don't see the chat. And Nestor said, I'm going to sleep every day of the weekend. Okay, that is a plan. But what is the answer for the question? Uh, are you going to go to the church next weekend? So you have two options. You can say, yes, I am, or no, I am not, to answer that question. Are you going to go to the church next weekend? Okay, very good, Nestor. No, no I don't. Mm, very good try, but that is not the right answer. So you have to use the verb be. So you say, yes, I am, or yeah. no, I am not. No, Thank you, Luis. Good. Thank you, Alfa. Next question. Are you going to cook next weekend? Are you going to cook? Let's I am not cooking cook this weekend. Okay, you say, I'm, no, I'm not going to cook next weekend. I'm going, yes, I forget. Okay, very good. Uh, Alfa say, yes, I am. Cook. Okay, excellent. So those are your two options to answer the yes, no question. Are you going to in the activity? And you say, yes, I am. No, I'm not. Are you going to dance next weekend? Are you going to dance? Let's see, Alexis, are you going to dance next weekend? So forget it about the chat. Can you please answer the question orally? Isidro? No, I'm not. no I'm not, said Magdalena. Isidro, are you going to dance next weekend? No, I don't. <laughs> okay, you say, no, yeah. I'm not going to I, dance. I don't. Okay. Oh, I am no, not I'm going. Not. No, okay. I'm not going. Okay. To dance. Very good. Uh, tonight we're going to talk about birthday plans and some special activities planned. So do you like birthday parties? Do you like birthday parties? Yes, I do. Yes, no, I don't. I am. Oh. <laughs> yes, I do. Or yes, no, I, I don't. So let's see, I'm going to share the presentation for tonight with you. So here we go. I'm sharing with you my screen. Let me know, please, if you can see it. Can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, okay. Yes, I see your screen. Thanks a lot. So birthday plans, we're going to talk tonight about this the plans that you had for your next birthday. So welcome to your class number three. And we're going to start with a minute. Here we go. Hold on a second. We are going to start with this party vocabulary. Let's see what is the name of that. Cake. Oh, it is a cake, it's a birthday oh. cake. It's a birthday cake. Like the cake. Yes. Oh, what about cake. this? Mariachis. Yes, mariachis. <laughs> Do you like mariachis? Yes, with my with my mother. No, I know. And what is the name of this? What is no, it? Blow, blow, balloons. Blow. Balloons. 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 Yeah. Balloons. Balloons. And the next one? 
Cheers. Thanks. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Cheers. Cheers. A toast or a champagne, wine. Similarly. Champagne. Hey, what about Whiskey, this one? Champagne cup. Whiskey to okay, have a dinner or going to a restaurant. So reception. So cake, balloons, champagne, live music in a reception. ¿Cuáles de estas cosas han habido en alguno de sus cumpleaños? Which of those things have cake. you ever had cake. in a birthday party? Cake. Balloons. Balloons. All of that. All of that. Oh, all all of music in All of that. Lead music in a reception too. Very good. Yes. Wow, champagne. Gas soda. Coca-Cola. Gas <laughs> soda. Ah, okay, a cloud. A cloud. Okay, a cloud yeah. is very important in a birthday party, especially when they are children. Birthday party. So let's see next. Present. Do you know what a present? Present. What are present? Do you have any idea? Regalos. Gift. Yes, Regalos. Your present. Regalos. present. Yes. Yeah. Piñara. No. What about piñara? Do you piñata, still piñata, piñata. do you still piñata. like piñaras? Unicorn. Oh. Pequeño pony. Snack. Dulce. A snack. A snack. Candies. 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 Candy. Candy. Oh, what about snacks? What's the meaning of snacks? Candy, boquitas, boquitas. Okay, very good. Merienda. Ahí boquitas. Está. Boquitas o bocadillos. Very good. Botanas. Botanas. Yeah, food. 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 Sí, in Mexico. Candies. Mm. What about candies? Dulce. Swift, swift. Yes. Dulces. Dulces. Okay, so in a birthday party, Nutella. we have um, a lot of, of these things, right? Present, piñata, snacks, candies, eh, a clown, food, sandwiches, hot dogs, hamburgers. So let's see the next. Music. Thing. Oh, lead music to music. So my next birthday party plans. My next birthday party plans. Um, any volunteer to read these examples? Who wants to participate? Help me, please, reading these examples. Me. Thank you. I am going to have a party at my house yard. I am going to decorate. I am going to buy some balloons. I am going to make cake. I am going to buy some snack. I am going to invite my family and friends. I am going to have some wine and champagne. I am going to serve chicken and meat with rice and salad. People are going to give me presents and good wishes. Excellent, excellent job, thanks a lot. That was awesome, very good. So Thanks, I'm, teacher. I'm going to have a party at my house yard. What is my house yard? What is the meaning of that phrase? At my house yard? El patio. Yes, in el patio, right? In el patio de yes. mi casa. I'm going to decorate. Do you like to decorate for your parties? Yes. yes, with with balloon. Uh, balloons. Okay, we use balloons. And, and color, color paper. Yeah, paper piñara, yes. piñara. I am going to bake a cake. What's the meaning of the verb bake? I'm going to bake a cake. I don't know. That I go to ask. bake a cake. But that means bake. Bake es hornear. So I'm going to bake a cake. Oh. Hornear oh, a cake. Yes. New word. New word. Okay. Take note. New word, um, new word for my vocabulary. 
Okay, excellent. So I'm going to buy some snacks. I am going to buy some snacks. Alguna boquita. Okay, excellent. I'm going to buy my family Voy and a friends. Unas boquitas. Exacto. That is the that is the meaning. Churros. Yes. <laughs> the famous churritos. <laughs> so I'm I'm going to invite my family and friends. I'm going to have some wine and champagne. What is Maybe wine? Maybe some birds. Maybe some birds. Okay, you know. probably. I'm going to have some beers. Yeah. I'm going... <laughs> La cholotona. <laughs> I'm going to serve chicken and meat I'm with rice dress. and salad. And salad. What is meat? Yes. What, is, what is the meaning Carne. of meat? Carne, yes. Uh, oh, yeah. Rice, rice, arroz, 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 arroz. And arroz y ensalada. Very good. So the last sentence is: People are going to give me present and good wishes. People are going to give me present and good wishes. This is one of the sales. That's the best of the party. Yes, the present are the best things of a birthday party. You are right. And good wishes. What is the meaning so of good the wishes? Sales. Yes, you're right. Buenos deseos. So interesting, right? So let's uh, have this practice. Think about your next birthday celebration and answer this question. Are you going to have a birthday party? Are you going to have a birthday party? I'm not. The answer there is it, yes I do or yes I am. Yes I do. We have, we have to use that's the- affirmative, affirmative answer, no? We have to use the verb be to answer this question. We are using yes. the verb be, so we need to use the verb be to answer. You have to say, yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Oh, no, I'm not yes, yes, going I to yes, have I a am. party. Have a birthday party. Yes, no, I am not. Not oh. going yes, to. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. In I April. Am. In April, okay. April 17th. Okay, very good and very good answer things. Then the next question is, when is your birthday exactly? When is My your birthday, birthday is exactly? September 16th. My birthday is November. My birthday is on September 16th. Okay, excellent on answer. April 17th. On, on April 17th. 17th. On April 17th. November 5th. November 5th. The next one, what are you going to do? What are your plans? What are you going to do? Eat, drink, and sing. <laughs> drink and sing. Okay, think about your next birthday celebration. Piense un segundo eh, sobre la celebración de su siguiente okay. cumpleaños. Take a second. What are you going to do that day? I'm going to do listen to the music. Okay, excellent. I'm going to listen to music. I'm going to invite a lot of people. Excellent. I'm going okay. to invite a lot of people. I'm going to invite just a near relatives. You are going to invite your close, your close relatives. Close, close or close? How do close. you write it? Like? Close, C-L-O-S-E, close. Okay. close. Close, close. I'm going to do. That is, and las personas que están cerca. That is what you many, want to say. Many things. Close, all right, got it, thank you. I'm here I'm to help to you, don't things. worry. Okay, are you ready? We're going to share this. Yes, second. 
Here we go. Any volunteer to start? There were three questions. Habían tres preguntas. Let's start with any volunteer? Any volunteer to start this practice? What are to do? Ah, you have to answer the three questions that were on the slide. The three questions and the presentation. Las tres preguntas que estábamos viendo. So, any volunteer? I'm going to invite uh, clo close. close. Your close, close family, okay? Or your close, close. friend. Family. Okay, very good. The first question is, are you going to have a birthday party? Let's start with Luis. Luis, are you going to have a birthday party? Yes, I am. Excellent, very good. So when is your birthday exactly? My birthday is on June 28th. Excellent, and what are you going to do? Uh, I think I'm going to do... Uh, uh, meet. Ah, okay. Salad. You are salad. going to you are going to serve meat and salad. Very and good. Salad. Are we invited to that party? Are we invited? Uh, yes, I. That's okay. You uh, you come. Ah, okay. So you say yes, you are right. <laughs> you yes, can you come. Are. Okay, very good. Thank you, Luis. Choose one of your classmates. Luis, can you please choose one of your classmates? Sorry. Can you please choose one of your classmates? Uh, that's okay. Let me see. Uh, Isidro. <laughs> Isidro, okay. Okay, Isidro, here's okay. the question. Are you going to have a birthday party? Yes, I am, teacher. When is your birthday exactly? My birthday is in... April 70th. Um, oh, April um. 70th. Okay, excellent. And what are you going to do? Um, April 70th. Thank you very much. Uh, what, I, what are I going to do? Mm, I'm going to invite uh, just the family. We are going to eat meat, salad, and we are going to hear music. Listen, we're going to listen to music. Okay, we're going to listen to music. Thank you very much, very good answers. Thanks a lot. So choose the, last, choose the last volunteer tonight. Ah, <laughs> ta -da -da -da. Uh, Magdalena Benitez. Okay. Hello, Magdalena. Good evening. Hello. Okay. Good evening. Can you answer the three questions? Okay. The first one, are you going to have a birthday party? Yes, I am. When is your birthday exactly? It's on October 11th. What are you going to do for your birthday party? Maybe I'm going to celebrate with my family and order a cake, maybe, too. Okay, very oh. good. Nice. You are going to order a cake. Nice. Uh, choose one. Choose one of your classmates, the last one. I promise it's the last one. Okay. Uh, Nestor. Nestor. Ivan. Hello, Nestor Ivan. Good evening. Hi. Good evening. Are you going to have a birthday party? Uh, no, I know. No. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. I'm, I'm so sorry. sorry. <laughs> I'm <That's laughs> sorry for, for today. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's continue with the class. Let's no more questions. No more no. questions. I'm so sad. Oh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so sad to hear that. So let's continue with the class then. So these were the three questions we were talking about. Uh, can you see my screen? Can you please let me know if you can see my screen? 
Yes, yes, sir. Yeah, I see your screen. Thank you very much. So look at this small conversation, Valentine's Day. Is it important mm -hmm. for you this uh, special occasion or this celebration? Is it important for you, Valentine's Day? Do you celebrate this? Yes, it's mm -hmm. a day very important uh, who, uh, for my wife. Oh yes, right, especially for women, this day is really important, Valentine's Day. So this is a conversation between Mona and Tyler. So Tyler, are you going to do anything special for Valentine's Day? And Tyler answered, yeah, I'm going to take my girlfriend out for dinner. Oh, really? Where are you going oh, to go? Naguna is her favorite restaurant. Oh, she's going to like that. How about you? What are you going to do? And Mona asks, answer, sorry. Mona answered, well, I'm not going to go to a restaurant, but I'm going to go to a dance. And Tyler says, sounds like fun. Well, have a good Valentine's Day. Thanks, you too. Now, what is Mona going to do? What is Mona going to do for Valentine's Day? She's going to dance. Maybe a party. Okay, she's going to go dancing or she's going to go to a dance. And what about Tyler? What is he going to do? He is going to take her, her wife and uh, go eat for a restaurant. Okay, a excellent. Restaurant. Yes, he's going to take her girlfriend, his girlfriend out for dinner. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, no, very good. Your answer was perfect too. So let's see, what are you going to do for Valentine's Day? Do you have a plan? What are you going to do? In, in my case, I'm going to take my wife um, eat out to okay. a restaurant. Out for dinner, out for a restaurant. Out for dinner. I'm ah, sorry, but I'm trying. <laughs> ah, you are doing good. Don't worry. You are doing good. Okay. You're doing an excellent job. Don't worry about that. Any other answer? What are you going to do for Valentine's Day? It's coming, right? It's near. Yeah, next month. Yeah, it is next month. Next month. February 14th. Um, it's going to, uh, there is going to be a pay money. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you are, are going to have money. So no excuses, right? No money, excuses. Yeah. There are no excuses. It's the, uh, per the perfect day. <laughs> Okay, um, any other plans? Any other plans? What are you going to do for next Valentine's Day? Tell me, what are your plans? I think uh, I'm going to I'm going to go with my with my wife uh, dancing in the, that, that day. Okay, very good. Any other plan for that day? Okay, then let's change the question. Do you have any question about the vocabulary in this conversation? Anything? Uh, ever, I, um, I think it's uh, interesting with your girlfriend or your wife in the Valentine's Day drink uh, a, a cup of beer, whatever, and listen to music like 80s and remember uh, when you were young, I think. Okay, yes, um, very good. That is a very good uh, way to celebrate this day, right? Uh, to be alone with your wife or your husband, and enjoy that day. So you can have a good time celebrating this, this day. So let's see this. We are going to study information questions. 
look at this. What are you going to do for Valentine's Day? So we can mm -hmm. answer yes, I am, or no, I not do this question. We need to keep information. That's why the name, information question. We need to keep information to answer this question. The first one, what are you going to do for Valentine's Day? So no podemos responder sí, no a esa pregunta. Tenemos que dar información. ¿Qué va a ser para el día de San Valentín? So look at this. I'm going to go to a dance. So you say a plan, right? You answer with a complete sentence. It could be affirmative or negative. The first example is affirmative and say, I'm going to go to a dance. The next is negative. I'm not going to go to a restaurant. Uh, look at the names. Where are you going to go? Is asking for a place, right? Where, donde, where are you going to go? And you say, we're going to Lagunas, to Lagunas restaurant. Mm -hmm. We are not going to stay home. No estaremos en casa. Vamos a ir al restaurante que se llama Lagunas. So how are you going to get there? How are you going to get there? ¿Cómo vas a llegar a ese lugar? ¿Cómo te vas a ir? So we're going to drive. We're going to drive our car. Vamos a conducir nuestro carro. We are not going to take the bus. No vamos a ir en bus. We're going to drive. So who's going to be there? Who's going to be there? Now, this is asking for a person or people. ¿Quién va a estar ahí? ¿O quiénes van a estar ahí? So my friends are going to be there. My sister isn't going to be there. So we get information. And to make this type of questions, to make this type of question, we are going to need this structure. We are going to need a WH word. ¿Cuáles son estas WH word? ¿Se recuerdan? WH word. Who? Who is one? Who? Which other one? What? Where? Yes, you're oh, right. Yeah, cool. What? Where? Which? When? How? Where? How? What? How? Who? Who? Which? 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 Yes. When? Which? When? 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 How many? How, how many? How many? Yes. Man, how many? How much? How much? How much? Which one? And one is missing. Why? What is the meaning of why? Por qué? Por qué? Yes. So we need this structure to make information questions. You say W is work. Look at this example. W is work. Uh -huh. What? Verb be at uh -huh. subject you going to. Uh -huh. The verb is do in the sentence and the complement is for Valentine's Day and the question mark. Los yes, and the question mark. So we have the question, what are you going to do for Valentine's Day? So look at the following special occasion or holidays in the United States, United States celebration. New Year's Day is on January 1st, Valentine's Day, so on February 14th. Independence Day is on July 4th. Halloween. Halloween is on October 31st. Thanksgiving, fourth Thursday in November. And Christmas, December 25th. December 25th. So let's see. Um, I know that it's January, but what are you going to do for New Year's Day in 2023? What are you going to do? No, I don't. No, stay at home. Stay at home. Because many places in El Salvador, uh, there are a lot of people. Too full. Okay. Um, Yes, you're right. The, the places in El Salvador are crowded. They are full of people. And we, 
we have to take care of our health yet, right? Unfortunately, the pandemia haven't finished yet and we need to be careful. So if it's better to stay at home. Valentine's Day, what are you going to do for this celebration? To dance. And Independence Day, when is Independence Day in El Salvador? September, it's on September 15th. September 15th. Okay, very good. So Halloween is the same day oh. of the United States in Thanksgiving. So let's read some plants. I have here some examples for you to read. Making plants. So let's see the first one. Any volunteer to read the first plan? It's about Halloween. Me? Thank you, Luis. Okay. Always go. Halloween is going to be on October <laughs> 31st. I'm going to go to party. I'm going to wear wear, wear a Halloween costume. I'm going to ask for candy or chocolate. Christmas okay. is going to be on December 5th, 25th going to cook a delicious dinner for my family. I'm going to invite some friends, some friends too. We are going to have a dancing party. Excellent, Luis. That was a great job. Thank you very much. So let's we'll see the first one. Good. We'll be good at party. In the first paragraph, do you have any question about the vocabulary? Halloween is going yes. to be on October 31st. What is your question? Excuse me, I'm sorry. Uh, December 25th or December 25th? 25th. 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 Thank you. Yes. 25th. 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 Any other question? A costume. What is a costume? Halloween costume. I I'm going to wear a Halloween costume. Costume, costume. Eh, traje, de, traje de Halloween. Oh. All the people make up. In... Disfraz. Chef. Un disfraz. Yes, you're right. Disfraz. Okay. Um, yo voy a usar un disfraz. Voy a vestirme con un disfraz. Very good. So I am going to ask for candies and chocolate. So this is a um, tradition in the United States, right? They wear the custom and they go knocking the doors and people give to children and candies and chocolates. So is it the same in El Salvador? In El Salvador, we ask for money. <laughs> we ask for money. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Okay. Double like. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go with the second paragraph. Christmas. It says Christmas is going to be on December 25th. I'm going to cook a delicious dinner for my family. I'm going to invite some friends too. And we are going to have a dancing party. Salute. Making plans. Talking about plans for a special date or a special occasion. Any question, any new work in the second paragraph? No any question, question? No, no question. No any question. All okay. clear okay. with the, with the Break squad. Break it. Let's go with the next example. Sign Valentine's Day is going to be on February 14th. I am going to take my wife on a date. We are going to visit our favorite restaurant I am going to buy her some beautiful roses. Any question in this paragraph? Teacher, uh, I'm going to take, uh, what does it mean my that? My wife on a date. Oh, tener llevar, una cita. llevaré. Oh, tener una cita con mi esposa. Ah, sí, es, tendré una cita con mi esposa. Okay. Ah, ese día es para ella, ¿no? 
<laughs> yes. <laughs> both, so, both, both, both. Yes, of course. It's I am both. going to take my wife on a date. It's <laughs> both. Ambas, bravo. Ambas. Si no, yes. no hay cena ni desayuno por una semana. Una de noche y una de día. <laughs> so we are going to visit our favorite restaurant and I'm going to buy her some beautiful roses. Right. And do you like roses? The women in the class, do you like roses? I'm going to buy roses for my wife. Okay, so de esta manera uh, hablamos acerca de los planes que tenemos para las celebraciones uh, que vienen, ¿verdad? En el futuro. So you say San Valentine's Day is going to be on. You say the day. And you say, I'm going to take my wife on a day. That is one plan. Next plan, we are going to visit our favorite restaurant. And the third plan is I'm going to buy her some beautiful roses. So, so we can we can use these examples to answer the question, what are you going to do for San Valentine's Day? So you say, I'm going to take my wife on a day. I'm going to take out my wife for a dinner. And we are going to go to the lake. We are going to to go to the mountain. So plants, talking about plants. So what are you going to do for Halloween? What are you going to do on Christmas? So you, you answer in this way. Right? So you say, I'm going to cook. I'm going to fight crackers. I'm going to stay at home with my family. Uh, I'm going to have a dinner with my family. So we are going to go out to a restaurant. So plants, using going to, do you have any question? Do you have any question about how to make plants and use the going to? Questions, question, this is the moment for you to ask. No, everything is clear. Okay. Okay, then let's go with this. And um, this part is about pronunciation and the reduction of the sound going to. So in informal context, people in the United States use gonna. ¿Ya han escuchado esa expresión, gonna? Yes. Yes. Um, yesterday, um, uh, Isidro was using this yesterday, right? You say, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. So we use gonna instead of going to in informal context. I'm gonna. It is informal, right? It is informal. And it is used especially when people is speaking and in some lyrics. So you are going to listen in, in songs and when people is speaking, but no in writing, no in readings, right? No in books. In English formal, no vamos a encontrar este sonido. That you don't I'm gonna do be. So you can write it, but you can uh, say it. Gonna. Uh, you can say it, but you can't write it. Okay. Yes. Yeah. It is for spoken English. Generalmente este sonido se utiliza en el speaking break. Cuando estamos hablando, um, you are going to listen instead of going to gonna. Look at this example. Are you gonna have a party? Are you gonna have a party? No, I'm gonna go out with a friend. Are you gonna go to a restaurant? Yes, we're gonna go to Nick's Cafe. So instead of saying going to, we are going to say gonna. If you want to sound more natural, more natural when you speak in English. So instead of going to, you can say gonna. Are you going to gonna have a party? No, I'm gonna go out with my friend. Are you gonna go to a restaurant? So yes, we're gonna go to Nick's cafe. So let's make a try. So we can we can say both going to and gonna. Yes, we can both, we can are, use, okay. both are okay. But when speaking, uh, okay. people gonna is more useful. Gonna is más utilizado. Especialmente okay. en conversaciones eh, con familiares, con amigos. Informales. 
informales, right? They say, okay. go on. All let's, right. Please okay, please. let's try. Let's Volume. try this. Uh, any volunteer to read sentence one and two using the sound gonna? Any volunteer? Okay. One and two. Thank you. Yes. She is gonna, she is gonna uh, to dance at the, the party. They are gonna uh, do it gonna... a lot. Okay, we thank are, you. We are gonna speak with our friends. Okay, the next. We are gonna sing at the party. I'm gonna cut the birthday cake. I'm gonna drink wine. Okay, um, is it difficult? Oh no. no, no, it isn't. Okay, very good. So she's gonna. It's easy. It's easy. Okay. Any other volunteer to practice this? It's very easy. Any other volunteer to practice? She's gonna to dance at the park. They are gonna to eat a lot. We are. Okay. I'm gonna to speak with our friends. He's gonna to sing at the party. I'm gonna to cook the par birthday cake. I'm gonna to drink wine. Thank you very much. But um, very good try. But pay attention to this part. The sound gonna cover this. Cubre todo esto. Going to. Going to. No, no, no se pone el to, entonces. Entonces no Solo decimos gonna, gonna to. Yes, decimos gonna dance. Gonna, dance. gonna, gonna eat. Gonna, gonna speak. speak. Gonna, gonna speak. sing. Gonna, gonna cut. Gonna, gonna, gonna drink. Gonna drink. Is it clear? Right. Is it clear right. now? Yes. Now is it clear? Now is it clear? Okay, thanks a lot. Uh, the last volunteer she's to practice gonna, this. Gonna, uh, the party. She's gonna gonna dance at the party. Yes. They are gonna eat a lot. They are gonna eat a lot. We are gonna speak with our friends. He's gonna sing at the party. I'm gonna the birthday cake. And I'm gonna drink wine. Excellent, thanks a lot. So yeah, any question? Yeah, any question with this? No questions? Pretty good, no question. Uh, okay, very good. It's a little bit easy, right? It's a little bit easy just to change the sound. Going to for gonna. So let's go to the next practice. A little this. Look at this, a small group conversation practice. Small group conversation practice. Uh, you are going to share with your classmate the plans for your next birthday. So we are going to ask you these three questions. Number one, what are you going to do? Number two, where are you going to go? And three, who are you going to celebrate with? So for your next birthday, think about the answer of these three questions. What are you going to do? ¿Qué va a hacer para su próximo cumpleaños? Where are you going to go? ¿A dónde va a ir para su próximo cumpleaños? And who are you going to celebrate with? ¿Con quién va a celebrar? So what are you going to do? You say, I'm going to have a birthday party. Where are you going to go? I'm going to go to the shopping mall. I'm going to go to the beach. I'm going to go to a restaurant. I'm going to go to a touristic place in El Salvador. Who are you going to celebrate with? And you say, I am going to celebrate with my family. I'm going to celebrate with I'm my friends. co-workers. I'm going to celebrate with my wife, with my friend. So are you ready? You are going to share with your classmate in the breakup rooms. One minute for you to copy these three questions. Is it okay? 
Yeah. Let me one moment, please, teacher. Are you ready? <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Let me write that question. Okay. Are you ready? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Are you ready? Yes, we are. I'm ready. Okay, here we go then. Let's go to the breakout rooms. I'm going to stop sharing the screen. I'm going to make the group. We are 15. Give me a second. We are going to make my group. So here we go. You are going to answer this three question. So uno de ustedes hace las preguntas y los demás responden para que practiquen. Is it clear? Let's do it. Okay, here we go. You are going to have five minutes to do complete this activity. Oh. Por ahí les va a llegar la invitación para que se unan a los breakout rooms y you can practice with your classmate. Alexis recibió la invitación para unirse a los grupos con sus compañeros. Okay. Hello, Alba, what happened? Alba, do you have a problem for getting together with your classmate? Ya lo activó en el icono del micrófono. Hay una pestañita, le da clic y le da a entrar audio por computadora o audio por teléfono. O es el micrófono al que no le funciona algo.
And the last one, Leonardo, who are you Hi. going to go with? Who are you going to go with, with your wife? Yes. With her wife. Yes. We got it, my, my friend. We got it, my friend. Thank you. And what about Heidi Lopez? Heidi, are you there? Leonardo. Hi. Answer Heidi is, is if she or he is there. Hello, KD. Are you there? I know. Hello, SNS. KD, hello. Good evening. <clears throat> Are you there? What? Probably his microphone. <laughs> Probably is her, her microphone. <laughs> that happened. That sometimes happens. Okay. okay. Let's suppose that. So what are you going to do for your next birthday? Can you share with me? What are you going to do for your next birthday? Yes. Clear, my friend. For example, my friend Leonardo DiCaprio, eh, He's going to go out with her wife in her in his birthday. Okay, excellent. And what about you, Isidro? Uh, my birthday. Uh, I'm going to celebrate with family at home. Okay, nice. And with Leonardo, all of my family. Leonardo, where are you going to go? Where are you going to go with your wife? Um the beach ah, you're going to go to the beach very good uh what is your favorite beach here in el salvador do you like el tunco beach yes 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 okay nice um it's what, a nice more? Tunco beach what more what more what more? Are you going to buy a cake for your birthday? Are you going to buy a cake for your birthday? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Yes. Yes, I am. Okay, pretty good. What is your favorite? Ah, oh, chocolate is your... That was the question, right? Uh, you give me the answer first. But the question was, uh, oh. what is your favorite cake flavor? Leonardo said chocolate. What about you, Isidro? Oh, um, my favorite uh, flavor in a cake is vanilla. Oh, vanilla. Okay. In Okay, nice. Do you like fruits on your cake? Yes, of course. Like, like um, how do you say duraznos? Beach? Uh, peach. We say peach. Peach. Okay, peach. And strawberries. Strawberries and grapes. And grapes. Okay. Grapes. Yes. Delicious. They are they are delicious. Okay. See you in a yeah. minute with all your classmates. See you in a minute. I'm going to stop All right. the practice. You did a great job. Thanks a lot. Thank you very yes. much. Yes, let's do it. Get back. Hello, hello. Welcome back to the class. How was your practice? Did you finish? Did you finish your practice? Finish. Yes, we finished finish with, with my yes. partners. Okay, very good. Let's listen to an answer. Where are you going to go for your next birthday? Where are you going to go for your next birthday? Donde van a ir? In my case, 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna grand party in my yard. My yard. Okay, I'm gonna have a great party um, in my yard. Okay, in my yard. <laughs> excellent. So, a great party, right? It is yeah. really, really nice with all my neighbors, with all your neighbors and family and friends. Yeah, okay. So, do you have any question about tonight class? Questions? No, any question, teacher. Okay, so thank you very much for being here with me tonight. And don't forget, please, about the platform exercises. It is important that you complete those exercises. Remember that you have to complete section one and section two during this week. And okay. tomorrow is our last class of the week. So please keep working on that. Don't forget about that. If you have some free time during the day, uh, don't forget about that, right? So enter to your account in the platform and start working on the exercises. Uh, any other question? Any other comment? Tomorrow, we are going to be talking about the body parts and about common illnesses. Uh, vamos a recordar las partes del cuerpo y también vamos a aprender acerca de las enfermedades más comunes, ¿verdad? Que nos afectan. That is the topic for tomorrow. Wow. So I hope to see you at 8 p.m. Thank you very much and sleep well. See you tomorrow. See you Thank tomorrow. You. Have a good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye, bye everybody.